previously in Cyberpunk 2077. Look, they're big boys. They can make their own big boy decisions. Listen, we saw Mitch. They probably got Scorpion too. We'll find them, help them out. Yeah, combat mechs. I was not planning on combat mechs. Scorpion, the rest. I, I'm sorry we didn't get here sooner. They were good people. Great people. They didn't have to die here. Please the tire track start there. tell me we'll you're not having me drive something with more than two wheels. And then I have... <laughs> Some nefarious ideas. Honestly, I don't know what hurts more. The death and reboot when I was pretty certain I'm nigh unkillable. Or the thought of having to do this fight over again. And now to continue. I suppose there's no point wasting any more time. Let's see if, uh... I can refrain from making the same mistake twice. Alright. Now, I was doing just fine. Right up until the point that I chose to, uh... Rush the building. So... Let's try and just not do that part. Um... Was it assist mode I wanted for this one? Or friendly mode. Let's put it in a friendly mode. No, friendly mode means it won't attack me. But unless they are hostile, it won't attack them either. Which is fine for now, I suppose. All right, so that's phase one. I see cars, Nomad. Mm -hmm. I recognize them, the clans. Where are you again, exactly? Yeah, never mind. Seriously? Oh, right, sniper. No, that does make sense. Okay, that should have been enough time to pass. Uh, let's... Can I destroy this? Will that destroy that? It did. Excellent. That's what I want next. We're just going to get rid of the bots. Works really good on bots. And one last thing before we start worrying about snipers. I want to get rid of this guy up front with my splody barrel again, or whatever you want to call this thing. Um. No. Oh, it's focusing on him. Come on, optics. Really? What, am I too far away? Must have been, because now it's working just fine. Okay, what if I overload a pump, a gas pump? Will that have the same effect? Let's try this one. Oh! Oh, I'd say that had an effect. Okay, if I remember right, there's also a guy over here that I did not account for. Yeah, there you are. Oh, and he's got a grenade in his pocket. But apparently it didn't... There it goes. <laughs> yeah, good luck finding me when... Uh... The target is very much not a part of this world anymore. That was good. That was really good. Don't suppose I can do that again. 
Who else do we have that maybe I could take advantage of things like that with? There's looks like another gas pump back there, but I can't see it effectively enough. Ooh, here's somebody. Aw, no grenades in his pocket. Is there something nearby I can overload, though? What if I just distract him? Well, that didn't work. Oh, you have got to go. Provided I can figure out where you are. I kind of see him. Will this work? Come on, dude. Smile for the birdie. You won't get out of this alive, you bastards. There we go. Nothing to see here. Nothing at all. They will regret this. Seriously, how did that alert everyone? He was by himself. All right. Nice of you to finally join me, Pan Am. I'm on him. Come on, Pete. But where? Okay, I still can't exactly see where the bullets are flying from. And the zoom in is not. Oh. In there? No, no, they're not coming from in there. I think somebody's using a smart weapon. I can't see. Ah, there you are. Well, let's just do this and see uh, what effect it has. Hey, there's someone. Okay, stop that. Still, no, stop that. I want to zoom in. Still having an issue. Yeah, see, that's the guy that's firing at me. And he's using a smart weapon. From inside the building, I can't get a target. What? Hey, I got him. I'll admit, I didn't expect to actually get that shot off. Okay. Hell yeah. I think I'm going to start sneaking down there. Let's not rush the place. I just, yep, and that's what I'm looking for. More targets to pinpoint. I see a sniper. Careful. But I killed the sniper up there already. Yeah, I see you though. There. No? How did you dodge that? That was a perfect shot. You're mine. Just like that one. Okay, should only be a couple of guys left. Sounds like one of them is in the store. I've also got to keep an eye out for any more turrets that I don't know about. Do you mind? With the advertising, kind of busy here. Alright, I think what I'm going to go ahead and do is... I'm going to make a beeline for the tower. Provided I can figure out how to sprint. Uh, 
Like, you'd think this would be an easy thing to figure out. You know, legs move forward really fast in a, in a, you know, faster than normal. It's called sprinting. But for some reason, no matter how hard I think it, it just doesn't happen. Okay. See, the Nekomata's a good sniper rifle. Hell yeah. But the one I got, it's just better. Ooh, that one was shiny. Uh, what can we do here? What do we got? Uh, BD55. Um, let's start with the uh, 5.5. Five. One C. 5.5. Five. Five, five, five. BD, BD. Hey! I'm amazed that worked. What did it do for me? Anything at all? Hey, here we go. Turn off. You know, where are these? Okay, this one. Okay, number two, we can just turn it off. Let's look at number one. Ow. Seriously? Ow. I'm busy here. Mind your own business. Are you kidding me right now? Nobody asked for your opinion. Go away. I'm busy. Turn on. Take over. Where is this? Aha! This one's in the store. Okay, let's take out some security apparatus here inside. And... And now this thing's useless to me. Damn it. Are there not more people inside? Well, that just sucks. Okay, well then let's turn that one off. And now if we look at this one, I think this is... Yep, this is just this one on the other side here. Nothing worth looking at, really. Except maybe... What are you talking about? Yeah, there's still someone around. The question is where? Ah! I saw you. So they are inside. Just not where that other turret was. All right. Well, Pan Am definitely seems to be having fun, but uh, is she actually getting results? Pan Am shooting the sniper rifle is fun, but if you're not actually taking out targets with it, it's kind of a waste of ammunition. Is my map. Uh, something's something's wrong with my my Kiroshis again. I don't know why, but they don't seem to be displaying necessary information, which is a bit of a problem. All right, where is this last person? Is there just one more person? I I think there's only one more person. Hell yeah. We stay together, we stay alone. 
You're the only one left, dude. I can't distract him with something from this side. See, and I still got stuff everywhere. Okay. Let's just head up to the roof and see what I can find. Careful! Target has corpse cyberware. It's not the only thing I've got. We stand against them. There we go. Ooh, what was that shotgun I just picked up? It looked nice. Okay, I think we're done here. Yeah. Oh, you have definitely seen better days, my friend. And uh, no, we're not done here. There's still someone else. I heard that. Where are you? Inside? Ah, you're inside. I'll kill you. No, you won't. I think that was it. Did I actually not screw it up this time? That'd be great. What's in here? Health booster. That doesn't seem worth it. All right, I've got... Ah, here's the thing I can... Open says me. I'm in. Helmet, he has to be here. Well, considering it... All Don't of... shoot, I'm unarmed. The hell are you doing here? This is my station. Name's Marty. Oh. Those fucking suits rode up like they own the place. Took everything. Put me here and locked the door. I'm sorry to hear that, man. Uh, you don't look concerned. Do you get customers? Did you see the? Uh, up, were they dragging some guy in? A man with him. A man I need. Civilian. You must have spotted him. Mm-hmm. I ain't blind. Where are they holding him? Old garage. Room upstairs. Probably keeping him there. Thanks. I were you. I'd stay put for a few. Exactly my intention. Good man, good man. Know where they're keeping Hellman. Going in. Okay, covering you. In just a moment. Uh, I kind of feel bad doing this. All right. Let's go here. Uh, and there, and that one. Nice. So do you even get customers out here? You even get any customers out here? Shit, anyone even drive this way? Anyone who don't like refueling with cameras watching them? Not many, sure, but they're all big tippers. You get me? In yeah. In exchange for your terrible memory. <laughs> don't you worry. I'll forget you too. Thanks, man. I like you. Okay, what the hell was that? We did talk, and now I'm gonna go kill your uh, customers. What's left of them? Oh my God! Why is that so loud? Any more goodies around here? Come on! I don't wanna. Leave completely empty-handed. The goodies are the best part of these gigs. Eh. Tier 4 item component. Sure. That's definitely a goodie. Alright, let's just open this up, shall we? With a... Can I not? I can't. It needs a passcode? Oi. 
It's not worth it. I'm already in the building. I'm not going to search for a bloody passcode to open a door that's inconsequential. Ooh, I will take the tier 5 components, though. Hell, for all I know, I've already found the code. But again, it really doesn't matter. Alright. What is with the really loud music? I don't get it. Mayor, yada yada, blah blah. Oh. Oh. There might actually be more in here. Okay. Is there a camera? Let's not get complacent. I did end one guy in here already. And the sniper rifle's probably a little too strong for close quarters. That's what I thought. And he wasn't alone. Oh, was it just a camera? Still not entirely convinced. Why would they only leave two men inside? Overconfidence, perhaps? I suppose it doesn't matter. I already got what I wanted down there. Can we uh, open the doors? Force open. I'm not strong enough yet. Damn it. She's still out there yelling. Pan Am is very enthusiastic about her violence. Uh, I like that. All right. I gotta play with any friends in here. Ooh, I saw that. That was a grenade. So I just picked up a free grenade upgrade. Not going to complain Bullshit. there. Hey, easy. We got to talk. Who are you working for? You're in Obu Arasaka. Do you wish to take me back or? Pathetic rat's got nowhere left to scurry off to. He's out of lifelines. Shut him up already. Uh, I'm far more concerned don't about his friend here on the I cannot stand. I can tell. Don't worry about that. Not a fan, I take it. You haven't found a fan in him either. Motherfucker doesn't know who to be scared of more. You or Arasaka. Well, I'm not gonna kill him, so he shouldn't be afraid of me. Arasaka, on the other hand, I can't vouch for it. Now you don't move. I cannot stand. Don't take this personally. Seem to recall you were gonna tell Takamura when you got Hellman. Yeah, just a sec. I'll call him. I, I gotta deal with this guy first. Okay, no, he's just a paramedic. He's not a threat. He doesn't have a weapon. All right. And I guess now's as good a time as any. Just remember, you have Hellman, and that's one hell of a card. Try to win something with it. Takamura saved my life, remember? Because it was in his fucking interest to do so. Still just biz. He's no friend of yours. Jeez, Johnny. Takamura, good news. Got Hellman. Alive. What did he say? Alive. Alive. Not too talkative now. Taking him to the Sunset Motel. I will come to you. 
put him there until I arrive. That's probably for the See best. Alright, buddy boy. You're coming with me. We've got some talking to do. And you... We were never here. You, go home, get yourself something to drink, have a nice shower, and pretend this never happened. Okay. Now, how much opposition am I going to have getting back out the door? No real opposition. More like my biggest problem is figuring out which door can I leave through. Considering I came in through the ceiling, this door won't open. Johnny. Any sage advice now, dumbass? Looks like your new chimbas are here. Is oh good, him? the Elder Caldos. Sure Take him outside. Toss him on the bike. A bike? Don't you, why he's unconscious a bike isn't gonna do the we need a truck or a van not not a motorcycle Seriously stay right there Dude's unconscious the Cavalry has arrived Mitch gathered together a few elder <clears throat> The road was clear. I don't think we were spotted We would still do better not to hang around too long What do you plan to do with him? Talk to him that's it. Just need him for some questions. Just gotta ask him a few important questions. I sure hope you get some important answers. Saul. Everything's done here. All Saul. Clear. Hey. Mitch is alive thanks to you. Thanks to V and Pan Am. They both saved my ass. I just hope he was worth it. Saul, well. I tried to race Scorpion, but he. Maybe I could help out somehow. I think you've helped enough. I tried to stop him. Sure. Just turn around now. Let it all be damned. You're good at that, aren't you? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, thanks for your help, thanks though. Thanks for the support. You helped us, we help you. Have a safe return. Not best to stir the hornet's it, nest oh. any more than it already is. This is this is a good thing. Hey, don't worry about Saul. He'll get over it. I don't give a damn. But he gives a damn about you, Pan Am. As soon as he heard what had happened, he ordered us to follow you. He was worried something would happen Saul? to you. Saul? That was his? Look, maybe you two don't see eye to eye at the moment, but your family and Saul will do anything for family. The thing is, am I even part of the family anymore? You know that. Uh, you yeah. Come I'd on. say this turnout kind of proves <laughs> that. I understand. You think they would have shown up in these kind of numbers for Sorry, anyone yeah, other than family? That. Things just get complicated. Dramatic sometimes. But I will manage. And you. You look out for yourself, alright? Yeah. What are you gonna do now? So, what now? Back to Night City? Yeah. I mean, I think so. I have to sit and think about everything. Maybe you should go have a conversation with your old man. Saul, Mitch, they really treat you like family. Maybe you should give them a chance. It is not that simple. Like any family. They're coming. You have about a minute to get out of there. Let's move! I'm also headed out. Take care of Scorpion's bike. It's yours. Really? Oh, you will not hear me complain. All right. It's time to wake up, Mr. Hellman. Hey. Where am I? What is this place? We're in a motel. Motel? Middle of nowhere. Any specific middle? Doesn't matter. 
You're not leaving here by yourself anyway. Why are we here? Because I need to talk to you about, well, my life. Want to talk about your little invention? Biochip you made for Arasaka. Fine. But let's get one thing straight first. Yorinobu Arisaka didn't send you? No. This means you must have an offer for me. If your boss will pay more than Kang Tao, I believe we can talk. I I don't I don't have a boss. I, I don't I don't have a boss. You misunderstand me. There is no offer. What do you want? Information. Got Silverhand's construct in my head. It's literally driving me crazy. And I know it's only going to get worse. That is, unless I remove it. And that? None of that's on the billboards I saw. Not even in the Silver final hand. Constructed. That's impossible. Where did you get this biochip? We stole it. Clept it off Yorinobu Arasaka. Job for a client. But the client left me out And of you decided the best place for it was in your own goddamn head. Actually, wasn't a bad idea. Construct rebooted me when my own goddamn head took a bullet. I always knew Yorinobu's plan would fail. And it's not like I had a lot of other options. It would turn out like this. Arisaka's prized tech really is in the very streets of the city. Uh. So can you help me get it out or not? You have to remove the biochip from my system. It's not that simple. Look, you made the thing, didn't you? So where's the problem? If you're telling the truth. You slotted in a new experimental version of the biochip. Experimental? Yeah, I know I can't just pull it out, but you've got to have some kind of technique. I know you can't just yank it out. My ripper you said- You showed that to some fucking street doctor? Who else knows? I needed help. Or did you think the first thing that came to mind was downing a Kang Tao AV? How's the prototype version different? It's got a different- Ingram, something more... Aware? Aggressive. The biochip is what's unique, not Silverhand's Engram. The previous version of the chip was only used to communicate with pre-saved Engram. It was rare as fuck and cost a fortune. Yeah. This one's rarer. Meant to install and activate the Engram in a new body. When I left Arisaka, the project was still in the trial phase. I see. So the whole point of this was to basically make someone immortal. Who could afford that? How do you put a price on immortality? Who could even afford tech like this? Nobody. This model was meant to remain in-house. The prototype for the was big man himself. Arisaka's personal commission. Oh. He oversaw the entire project himself. So if it weren't for you, Arinobu, nobody would have found out. And if not for you, the project would not have been a success. This is a true breakthrough. I don't consider what I'm going through right now much of a breakthrough. How exactly does this work? How exactly was this new version supposed to work? Are you planning to have the Engram kick people out of their own bodies? Is that shit by design? During the tests, we assumed that the body would be neurally indifferent. To Brain dead. Implantation. You mean dead? Yes, which makes what happened to you interesting indeed. Ah, okay, so congratulations, you got what you want. Now, can I get what I want, please? Yeah, yeah, great. Your tech works. Now get it out of me. Well, well. I would have to see it first. Ah, uh, fine. Okay. I don't like this. Hmm. Unbelievable. It looks like... Can't believe this Seuss the one who's gonna help us. Can you see him now that you're looking through my eyes? Oh, fuck. Well, what is it? What, what is it? What a pity I won't be able to examine it fully. Yeah, real shame. You could have been his guinea pig too. Tell me how to get rid of it. I can't. I'm afraid I have bad news. Your neural network has completely deteriorated. It can no longer function independently of the chip. So I'm screwed. The only thing I could Woo -hoo, do it's bargaining time. is to give you information on a good clinic in Sweden. They'll help you through the terminal stages. Minimize the pain. That's not much of a bargain. But you said the project was in the trial phase. 
You don't actually know how it'll end. Oh, I do. I just saw the construct devouring your brain. It's programmed to take over its new environment. At all costs. And your little meat brain is helpless against it. So no matter what, sooner or later the engram wins. Yes. And from what I've heard about Silverhand, that seems to be exactly his style. Huh. I see my reputation's grown into Arasaka legend. Not now, Johnny. We're having a serious conversation. So what exactly is going on? What exactly is going on in my head? You tell me. What's it like to have two personalities? Freaky. Because it's not like you're hearing voices. You are both yourself and Silverhand, simultaneously. Yeah, it's like I have a real imaginary friend. One that actually talks back to me. I can see him and talk to him. You're not talking, but yes, I understand what you mean. Have you noticed the Construct's influence on your decision-making? No, Jeez, I mean... Rest. He can't really make me do anything. When it comes to my decisions, Johnny really is just a voice in my head. Maybe he has a different opinion, but he can't make me do anything. Agreed 100%. You are one fucking stubborn It's not host. as if one of you wins the debate. The scale simply shifts. Slowly but surely. So you're saying that by him being in my head, my decision making is slowly turning into his. Is that what you mean? What do you mean? You will start doing things that were once unthinkable, at least to your old self. And you know exactly who he was. A fanatic. A terrorist. A suicide bomber. Oh, fuck me. Who's trying to mess with your head now? That is why I believe it would be better for you to consider clinical isolation at this stage. Uh... That just tells me you actually don't know don't Johnny as rush, well as but... you say you do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, Johnny's never made me do anything that I would morally object to. At least Johnny never whored himself out like you. Are you defending him? Or is that Johnny speaking now? Oh, let me guess. He already tried to take over your body. You know, just for a little no. while. Would you, though? Could be fun. Johnny? Kidding. But watch out. Suit's getting ready to talk your head off. All right. I think I've asked enough questions. You know what? That's enough. You just playing for time? Because I can't tell. Are you trying to convince me you're useless? I mean, in that case, I can just shoot you in the head and save us both some time. Oh, finally. I will try to help you, if you come with me to Kang Tao. Uh... Kang Tao? I'll try, just ain't gonna cut it. Actually, it's almost like you're trying to buy your way in with the Chinese at my expense. Do you even realize how much data is in your head? Even if I can't help you, the data must be saved. Well, fuck me sideways. And what can you what do I in Kang Tao talk. that you can't do he here? Forget Kang right. Tao. Got any other ideas? If you think there's anyone else who can help you, I could give you the blueprints. Complete project documentation. Kang Tao offered quite the sum for it. You got it with you? He's got to. Gonk's fucking useless without him. I could the go for that. Takamura. What the hell is he doing here? He's got a few questions of his own for you. You play nice. He might even save your ass. I'm almost done. The blueprints. Please, and thank you. It's not nothing, but it's a start. Maybe Vic can do something with these? Better than nothing. Long as we find someone fluent in Technobabble. I know a really good ripper, Doc. All right, so what are you going to do with them? What will you do with them? I haven't decided yet. Are you serious? You know me. I can be impulsive. Okay, what I'm looking for here is please don't kill him or maim him in any way that makes him useless. Otherwise... He's all yours. I'll give you two some space. I hope we can come to an understanding. That is certainly in your best interest. All right, well, hey, I will remember this. I hope so. Uh, this heat. Just don't remember it too hard. Positively parched. Mm. 
Whoa! Johnny! Now's not the time for Roller Coaster Tycoon. Ow. Sons of bitches. Can, can I go have a lie down, please? You really are paranoid. You don't see it? Way corpse are stripping our world and lives naked, piece by piece. Okay, can, can Can't I... Can't turn a blind eye to that. Could really... Whatever you gotta say, say it. I've got something eating at your can, code. Can I please sit down? Learn how you're wired this whole time. To know who I'm dealing with. Thought you were just unlucky at first. But I kept watching and finally realized what your problem is. You're a dirt girl from Haywood who found the guts to walk a few extra blocks from home. But turned out the best you can do is chase scabs for Annie's. Okay. And? You sure seem to know a lot about my past. Well, what exactly does that seen flashes of What are you saying? Just like you've seen flashes of mine. Okay. You scared? Honestly, I'm scared of the day I'll start seeing your memories as my own. Shit. If it's a two-way street, I'll somehow have to live with the fact that I let Deshaun best me. Fuck me over. You think I'll notice when I turn into you? Listen, will I notice the change? Or is it one of those things where I'll wonder why I ever feared it? Worse than you can do to a human. Rip their identity out of them. That's all I know. How you find life under my skin? Well, most things are either too big or too small. Not to mention the clusterfuck that are your hormones. And the lag between sight and touch. Infuriating. When you take a bite of pizza, it takes ages before I know you fucking burn the roof of your mouth. Plus, Used to be five minutes wouldn't pass before I had a fresh cig in my hand. Now I'm itching for nicotine. Getting used to it, I guess. But it's no fucking picnic. Uh, well, I mean, I'm not really much of a smoker, but I suppose we could, you know, find some common ground. But there's something deeper to this. What are you really looking for? Can you just tell me what you want? What you really want? Help me settle my score against Arasaka. There it is. Now you're talking sense. You've got a clear goal just like me. Your goal is to bury Arasaka. Demolish it. Mine's to stay above ground. Seem pretty clearly defined, both. Actually aligned pretty nicely, too. You need Mikoshi to save your life? That done, I can burn it to the ground. Uh... I hate to say this, but you're right. Okay. I'll tell you why I want to destroy Arasaka, but I'll only tell you once. Want to hear it? Uh, yeah. All right. I saw a corpse strip farmers of water, and eventually of land. Saw them transform Night City into a machine fueled by people's crushed spirits, broken dreams, and emptied pockets. Corpse have long controlled our lives, taken lots, and now they're after our souls. Might be right. I can't really argue with you there. V, I've declared war not because capitalism's a thorn in my side or out of nostalgia for an America gone by. This war's a people's war against a system that spiraled out of our control. It's a war against the fucking forces of entropy. Understand? Yeah, Johnny, I Do actually... Do whatever it takes to stop them, defeat them, gut them. If I gotta kill, I'll kill. If I need your body, I'll fucking take it. Hey, man. Fucking hell. You still don't see it. But you will one day. No, I do see it. 
Hell, it was like that in my own world too, just not quite so high tech. But I get where you're coming from, man. It's just, you gotta go about doing things the right way. And nuking a damn skyscraper isn't really the right way. Okay, can you know I what? get the feeling this grimes was really turning you on? Mm -hmm. Alright, Takamura is having his fun with Hellman upstairs. I I don't understand why we couldn't just stay in the car. Feel like I just got off the world's worst roller coaster and am ready to take a dive. So I think I need to find a bed. Will you rent me a room again? Hey man. You you won't you won't rent me a room again. Uh, nope, nothing I really want to talk about. Okay. I guess I'll just go have a seizure on a park bench then. What could possibly go wrong? <laughs> 